time to make another miniature video. I guess this is just the week for miniatures more than it is dolls. I haven't really got anything too exciting going on in the doll department right now until maybe next week and then I have some exciting things to show you. I'm hoping to do some box openings again but I have not gotten any new dolls since I started making videos again but I promise as soon as something new comes in I'm going to be doing box openings because I know that's what everybody likes uh, the most but for now I just have a bunch of miniatures to show you and I have another announcement I actually my family decided that they were taking me to the Chicago miniature show no matter what I said uh, because it's the thing I look the most forward to every year so they told me that I had no choice, that we're going. So yes, my mom and dad and my brothers and my husband are all going up to the world's biggest, supposedly, that's what they say, it might be true, miniature show in Chicago. So I'm really excited. And so that's next weekend and I will be doing a haul video of whatever I come home with. But for now, these are some really cute items that I got from someone in Thailand. I got these a few months ago but never made a video. This girl makes really cute miniature books and props for your dolls. So I got a bunch of Studio Ghibli books. We've got, surely this will focus. Maybe not. It does on one, it doesn't the next. This is Arietti and this is Kiki's delivery service. She makes really cute manga books. And I think inside there's actually, yeah, she totally, it totally does, has pictures of the actual, uh, I don't know where she gets these pictures for this, but they're super cute. And she also makes really cute little mangas which are great for doll shelves as well. I swear it focuses one minute and doesn't the next. But yeah, it actually has the full comic inside, which is so cute. So yes, I got a whole bunch of little love novels. Super, super cute. All kinds of different ones. So, so cute. And then, let's see what else. I have a bunch of those. Then I got a little paper doll book, which actually has real paper dolls inside and the sets for them. So cute. Oh my gosh, I never actually looked through this. These are really, really amazing. Let's see, more little mangas, of course, cute. It's cute, cute, and they're full color and everything. A really, really good quality. And more little paper dolls. Oh, it looks like, if I can get it to focus, that this one is actually Sailor Moon. Come on, thing, you have no choice but to focus on this. Come on. Well, you know what? I hate this camera. Even if you cover up the whole, like... But anyway, if you were able to see, this is Sailor Moon themed and it has all the little outfits in here, so that's really cute and I didn't actually notice that. Then she also makes these cute little notebooks. This is supposed to be a unicorn, if you could see it, and it actually has the lined paper inside. Sure, it focuses on the most boring things, the things that I'm actually really excited about showing you, it's not going to focus on. So yes, I got a couple, a few of these little notebooks, and the thing is, these come in sets, so you can get, you get a whole bunch of little books and stuff, you don't have to buy them individually, which is really nice. Um, here's some more. Well, it's Totoro and House Moving Castle. Let's see. She also makes, and this is amazing, she makes these little Nindroids. 
wings. There they are. And they look so real. And it has the whole package. And it even has the back. And it even has the barcodes and everything. It's so amazing. And in here, this is a little snack subscription box for your doll and you get all kinds of different little snacks in here of different kinds. <laughs> it's just this is just not working out in my favor today but anyway there's a bunch of cute snacks in there and actually I forgot something that is in the other room and it is my all-time favorite thing that this person makes I'm gonna run and grab them and I'll be right back okay so this is a continuation of the last video these are actually my favorite thing that this person makes she makes miniature remint sets guys now there's not actually toys inside, but it's the exact same box as you would get from Remint. It comes with one of the little books for the Remint that you would get. Tells you. And it comes with all the boxes of little Remint. So inside you get Here's the thing, she has a ton of different designs. So if you like a specific type of remit, say instead of these character ones, you like the food. Well, she has some of the foods and the regular remits, and then she has some character remits, which is what I'm more into. And I also bought a second one, which is Rilakkuma Cat. That looks just like the ones you would get in the mail or at the store if you are in Japan. So yes, absolutely amazing. So cute. So they're just perfect size for your little dolls. And I I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure that she makes them in more than just the 1 12th size. I'm pretty sure she makes them in 1 6th as well. So if you have a bigger doll, you can get a bigger set of remits so that it matches your doll better. I'm pretty sure. I will link her shop in the description box. It is an Etsy store and it is not expensive. And she is from Thailand and she makes the most amazing miniatures, mostly out of paper, but they're really good quality and really super cute. So you will have to check out her shop. And that'll be all for now, guys. That's all I have time to make today. Next weekend is the miniature show and I am so excited and I cannot wait to share with you all of my finds that I that I discover there. Oh, it's, it's like a pit of, it's just a money pit but I adore it. It's the best time of the year for me. So I will talk to you guys soon. Have a good weekend. Bye guys.